tracking. He eats four pounds of meat every day, and his favorite treat is liver. All right, and tonight, a Great Dane raised right here in Southern Nevada deserves all the treats he wants. And 13 Action News reporter Alex Frescas explains exactly why. <laughs> What's your dog's name, dog? Hey, dog. Did you hear the one about the 186-pound dog walking into the newsroom? You are so sweet. He becomes the big story. Dog, yep, his name's Dog, just got back from New York City, and he won best in breed at the Westminster Dog Show. His breeders and owners, Dr. Nick Spiritos and Dr. Vicky Mazzarano, were shocked when Dog was selected. We never dreamed that we would win best of breed. Ooh, I never thought we could win, but I thought, well, geez, we he might get placed. He, we, we were, were just so thrilled. Dog was born November 2016. In fact, this video was taken moments after his birth. He weighed 1.9 pounds. And this time lapse shown in Times Square documents his entire life up to this point. He was the first of six, um, so he's a six tuplet and he has five sisters. Dog first became a champion at 10 months old. Since then, he's traveled around the country to different competitions, and when he does it, he does it all in comfort. He's just the easiest dog ever. I've, we've, of all the Great Danes we've had, he's just the, he's a joy. Dog was also a joy to watch at Westminster. Dr. Spirito says the crowd's reaction was priceless. Wild, wildly enthusiastic. He, he got, I think the loudest cheers and <laughs> the, the building roared when and the announcers even mentioned how popular he was um, even though a Great Dane has never won this whole show in 140 plus years. Could Dog one day become the first Great Dane to win the entire show? Maybe, maybe not. Well, I think we should retire when we're on top because <laughs> I don't know where we go from here. We're not sure. We're, we may show him a little bit more, uh, but we just haven't decided yet. If you'd like to see Dog in person, the Las Vegas Great Dane Club is putting on a show in March. It's also a great way to support the Kennel Club and the Great Dane Rescue. Alex Frescas, 13 Action News. Yeah, we missed out. We that really was missed out. Our end time today. We missed Dog. Our entire newsroom was here except for that. us. All right. Now, if you can't make it to the show in March that Alex was talking about, you can always keep up with Dog daily. Of course, he has an Instagram account. He has a yes. fabulous life. I just saw it. You can follow him at Dog, yeah. the Great Dane.